Hello boys and girls and welcome to Shan Plays. Currently playing Crusader Kings 2. I just noticed up here Meath has taken even more of Scotland. So high five Meath. They now have the Duchy of Albany and the Duchy of Lothian under their control. They are just going gangbusters up there. Good good job. Three three duchies. Three duchies. So he has a good chance of taking over the whole Kano of Scotland, to be honest. Is he still at war? Yeah, he's fighting his own civil war, but that should be easy. But yeah, he has probably about a third of Scotland already. He's only missing one, two, three duchies if he wants to form the kingdom, or usurp the kingdom from this douchebag, this Lollard douchebag. Are you a Lollard? No, he's Catholic. So he's good to go. The kingdom of Ireland still exists, but they only have one county. <laughs> Fucking Lollard. She's just crazy. Maybe Meath will go up there and take that take that title, too. Anyway, we have stood down all of our levies. And that means we can go ahead and declare war again. And I'm thinking we should go over here for Barcelona. Because this motherfucker does not really have any allies. It's true he could get all the other Sunnis to help him. Like, to help defend. But, eh, I'm kind of banking on them not really giving him too much of a hand. So, why not? Holy War for Barcelona. Sounds good, because that'll gain us one, two, three, four, five more provinces. That sounds good to me. Let's raise our troops again. Let's send everyone over to Genoa. And our army is down here on the boat. Why don't we head them this way instead? Just start the invasion a little early. Oh, we'll go, we'll go to Barcelona and stand there, I guess. Or maybe we'll go stand outside Barcelona, and then when they invade, uh, we can kill them. Yeah, let's do that. We'll just go chill in Mallorca. Oh, we're chilling Casta Castellan. Oops. No, 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 no. Go back. Damn it. Go back. Damn it. Pleased to be getting on boat. Alright, there we go. Now they have a bunch of troops raised. And they should invade me. Man, they actually have a lot of troops raised. That is seriously a lot. And the Charki Sultan is going to help him. But they're down here, so I'm not that worried about it. At least not yet. Yeah, that's a lot of troops. Damn. Maybe we should... Yeah, we'll drop them off in Mallorca, and then we'll go get uh, this army over here and help out with them. But yeah, Hungary should be fighting these guys, Ascalon, so I'm not too worried about that. Oh, our daughter came of age. Very good. And our other daughter, the twin daughters, have come of age. Oh, man, she's got 21 stewardship. That is so delicious. So betrothed can marry. I believe it was a matrilineal proposal, right? Yes, it was. So let's get that underway. Good, good. Actually, can we do Cecilia instead? Because she's, she's the one with shitty stewards. Ah, eh, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter that much. Just get it done. All right. So she was marrying some guy. Yes, yes, I've already done it. Prince Yanko. Alright. So he's come to our court because uh, Poland has their own king right now. Oh man, he already has three baby boys. Goodness. Wow, he has been busy. So we're going to have to kill all three of those, unfortunately. And we... We'll also have to kill these two brothers. They don't have any kids, though. So there's five people we'd have to kill if we wanted to take over in Poland. Damn. Well, this plot is unfortunately going nowhere. We're actually losing plot power. So why don't we shift focus? Because I think this one's going to work out anyway. Because this guy... Oh, he got rid of his disease. Damn it. 
whatever. So let's uh, shift focus. None of these guys want to do that. Get rid of that. That's fine. All right, let's pick a new plot to kill your brother. Yep. Time for you to die. Oh, look. People want to kill you. Sorry about that, but people want to kill you. Oh, look. More people want to kill <laughs> Oh, Poland looks awesome. Everyone wants to kill everyone in Poland. Alright, that's all we're going to get. They're always so excited to join a plot. They're like, hell yeah, murder someone. Alright, 8,000 motherfuckers, get on the boat. Let's go stand you over here. I have to make sure they have good generals, too. Alright, go in back to the water. Get you some good generals. And we're good. Just chill in Barcelona. Uh, how's the plot going? 64%. So we could use some more percent. See, you're not going to change your mind. You possibly might change your mind. Probably not. Probably not. You will. You just need some dollars. There you go. He's like, oh, all right. I guess we'll kill him. You need some dollars, too. There you go. <laughs> I guess we'll kill him. 46%. No, we don't have enough chance. Uh, maybe it's possible, but probably not. Hey, it worked. Cool. Very good. Mm, probably not. Give it a shot, though. Oh, it worked. Cool. Sometimes when they're even, like they're even right here, 3 versus 3, sometimes when they're even, you'll still be able to get them to come. But usually you won't. Usually when it's 3 to 3 or 4 to 4, they'll say no. Anyway, let's uh, get those percentages coming in, see if we can get up to like 90 or something. Alright, here comes the big scary army. Oh yeah, who can we call into this war? France. Let's call France. Holy War for Barcelona. Come on, France. Who else can join? York? Finland. Yeah, you can help join. Uh, Sweden. I don't care about Sweden. I know that's harsh, but it's true. Poland, yeah, why don't you help? France is coming. Awesome. Love you, France. Actually, could we go stand in some mountains or something? Yeah, there's mountains here. Let's go stand in the mountains. That sounds more that sounds more better. More better. take a little bit of attrition, but defending the mountains is going to be awesome. Hey, Poland's coming. Cool. And Finland's coming. Sweet. I did not expect Finland to come. Alright, we should be fine. Alright, we're there. We're sieging. And I'm sure they'll attack us. Oh god, they have like 20 mother 20,000 motherfuckers. Uh can't raise any troops there, can't raise any troops there, can't raise any troops there. 
Well, who else can we raise? I'm sure we could raise more troops. I mean, this is three holy orders and my personal levies. We could raise 120,000 levies if we wanted to. That's a lot of levies. Let's get you guys. Only two ships. Let's get you guys as well. But we can't get any boats out of you. Let's get boats out of these guys. And levees. Beautiful. My goodness, that's a lot of boats and levees. Everyone on the boat. On the boat. On the boat. Oh, they won't even fit on their own damn boats. guys come up here. Wow, we're actually going to have trouble fitting all these guys on the boats. I'm surprised. Okie dokie. Let's get some more boats and troops. Wow, 3,600 guys. Our vassals really like us, don't they? Let's go over here and see if we can't fit you guys on the boats. Yeah, you as well. And everyone else should be fine. I think that should be enough troops. Well, let's actually take these boats and... Uh, boats, please. Boats. 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 There we go. And pick up these guys. Hopefully they'll be really quick. Child needs education. We will teach him ourselves. Uh, this could be a bad idea bringing this fleet away from my army. Now you can fit on the boats. Good, good. Let's come over here immediately. We will need you there. Actually, why don't you just stop right there, pick up these armies. We'll get back on the boat. Alright, there we go. Come over here. And yes, they are attacking us. Oh, we have plenty of time. 3rd of December, 13th. Yeah, have plenty of time. You guys get on the boat as well. Oh, yeah, we're good. Good to go. Oh, yeah. You guys can group up. Can't really fit that many more troops, though. We'll try to fit uh, more troops on the boats. Oh, it's just... You know what? We'll have to wait for them. We will wait for them. We'll bring you over here now. Everyone will ring over now, and then we'll come back for those troops. It's the only option we have. Oh, you guys as well. Come this way. Excellent. Wow, that is a big army that we're going to just land on their face. 3rd of December, eh? We'll wait until December 1st before we move. There we go. Yes, yes. All right. Now on we go. It should we should land on like the fifth or something. It should be fine. All right. Let's watch the battle. It's going to be harsh on the first couple days, and then all of a sudden thirty-six thousand, <laughs> and we're defending the mountains. <laughs> oh, poor motherfuckers. Yeah, it's slaughter. Oh, that's right. Let's pick up these armies. We killed 9,000 guys. We lost 1,500. Very good. This guy's got good martial skills, so let's execute him. Good martial skill. Execute him. If we can kill all their good martial skills, then they won't have any good leaders to throw at us. This guy's got terrible martial skill. We can just ransom him. 
You can use him any day. Hey, pause, pause, pause. They are running to Rosello. They're going to get there on the 6th of January. So let's get you guys on the boat. And we'll take these guys to Rosella right now. So we should be... Yeah, yeah, we got there ahead of them. Excellent. And we'll take you guys over to Barcelona. And then we'll take the other Navy to go pick up these guys. Alright, we're good. We're good. Excellent. That could not have worked out any better. That was just brilliant. And welcome to 1268. Alright, we have arrived on the boats. Let's go pick up these guys. Yeah, they're attacking us, and we're attacking them, and it's all cool. They're running to Leda, so we'll follow. Should be able to kill that army, I hope. And we captured a Count. He's got decent marshal, but not really good enough to really threaten us. Should have arrived over here. We have. Get on the boats, please. Hopefully we have enough room for those people. And you guys are running away over here. We'll follow. And your army was obliterated. Okay, so let's split up. We have our holy orders in here, right? I think, yes. Holy orders are going to go a separate direction. There we go. So support limit over here, 10k, 17k. All right, so we'll split up even further. Just under 10k, there we go. We go sit in Urgel. That'll be fine. Everyone's on the boat. That's nice. 7,000 guys. Let's go take this back. No, 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 no. Take the boat. Much faster. This whole jihad has been amazing. Oh, we got there first. We're defending. <laughs> And they're running back to Rosello. Okay. Can't really siege anywhere, so we'll just chill. They have 11,000 guys coming, but that's not enough to deal with us, so they're going to walk around and try to get to one of our smaller armies. That's fine. Have we arrived in Foggia? Yes, we have. Siege that down. Good, good. Get back on the boats. And let's go surprise butt sex these motherfuckers. Looks like they want to come attack either Leda or Urgel. That's fine. We'll be defending the mountains again. They're going to Leda. Okay. Okay, that army is toast. Man, the supply limit here sucks. 4k, and we're going to get out of there. We're going to go help this battle in Leda. Yep, 11,000 guys going to Leda. That's fine. We should actually go help. I guess we'll bring this army, the Teutonic and all those people. We're winning this war down here. Killed 3,000 of them. Very nice. Oh my god, 25 martial skill. Guess what? <laughs> Execute. There goes your 25 martial skill. And now we can get back on the boats. And go kill this army.
Aha, so we're going to kill this douchebag. Good, it's a start. Converted Ferez, okay. Still no luck in Ferrara. Oh, we're getting attacked over here, but we're winning. I guess we'll just let them keep attacking us. Nah, we should probably do something about it. Oh, the Sultan is in there. We might be able to... You no, know, we already have somebody coming over there. Cool. We are already on our way. And you guys are retreating, but you only have 355 guys, so I'm not going to bother. Why don't we bring you over to Barcelona? And we're at 56% in the Jihad. It's all good. So we're going to gain 100 piety and more... 207 piety, a little bit of prestige, and a little bit of moral authority. Or we could do white peace. He will do white peace, which means he'll lose piety, he'll lose more authority, and will gain piety. Yeah, I'm fine with that, just to get out of the war. Because we're not going to gain anything if we continue that. So that should end the Jihad. Excellent. Yes. Jihad called off. Excellent. So we got piety out of it. But it also means we're now going to have to pay for our holy orders, but that's okay. We're not the poorest of the poor. Oh, we inherited the county of Lyon. That's no good. Let's find somebody nice to give it away to. Steward of Salzburg. Oh, he has a claim. He has a claim as well. You're too old. Marshal of Brescia. You have a claim. You're craven, but you have a claim. Why must you have claim? Alright, you have no no claims, no nothing. You're a spy master. Good. You get Leon. Enjoy. Oh, we're actually losing over here now? Really? Oh, because two of our flanks ran away. But we have an army coming on the 11th. So if you can hold out for eight days, which you will, we'll be fine. Uh, success. Unfortunately... Damn it. So we killed him. He's dead. Murdered on the orders of Trojan of Warta. So not us. It was murdered on the orders of someone else. Interesting. Anyway, let's keep up our efforts. You're a little upset that we killed your kin. <laughs> Alright, let's kill the next one. No, I mean this way. Oh, we can't. We have no valid plots. Oh, there we go. Succeeded with a plan to kill. Alright, now we can re-kill. Let's re-kill another guy. Uh, we're going to kill you now. 12%. Sorry, dude, but it's time to die. Oh, look. People are lining up to kill you. <laughs> Sounds good to me. 1%, but hey, 1% is something. No guarantee we'll have enough plot power to kill him, though, but I guess 5%, 6%, it all adds up, right? 2%. Zero percent. Perfect. That's what I like. Zero percent. Alright, who's got the most percent? Six percent. You... Oh, I've already invited you, I guess. Already invited you. Already invited you. I guess I've already invited a lot of people. Alright. Okay, so we killed 8,000 guys. We lost 4,000. You don't really have any martial skill. We'll just ransom you. And that's all we took from that battle. So we could chase them down. They're running to here. So they're running over here to attack me again? Really? I guess we'll go defend. Ah, uh, curiosity never killed anyone. 
he got honest. Let's go this way. Yes, yes, we're plotting to kill the guy in Poland. I know, isn't it cool? My vassal's getting a little upset up with us, though, but... We'll get rid of all these... levies when the war is over. Alright, let's see if we can't add any more people now. Well, there's only three more people. How can we only have 47%? Well, I... shit. Why not? You just want some dollars? There you go. <laughs> That'll put us over 50%, which should be enough. Killed some more people, took another captive, you can be ransomed. Took another captive, 13, nope, you're gonna die. And some random douchebag. Just kill him, because we can't uh, ransom him. Oh my goodness, I thought the game crashed right there. Wow. Hold on one sec. Alright, there we go. I was just getting another episode of Shia uploading. And I guess France can deal with all that shit. Man, we have a lot of, like, disease and crap. What is this, anyway? Typhoid fever again. Kind of surprised we're not having much luck with this guy, but I guess he does have a good intrigue. He's at court in Glogo, Glogau, Lower Silesia. Donde estas Lower Silesia? Where is that? Lower Silesia, bingo. Alright, so let's send our spy master there. That's our wife. Good luck. She's like, why are you sending me to Poland? Well, it's for the good of the Deerman. Does that improve our plot power? It should. 54%. Why aren't there more people who we can draw in? Every, we've drawn in almost everyone we can. So even if we had everyone, it would only be 56% or something? I mean, that's ridiculous. Hold on. Count Annabelle of Arborea died during the battle, and Sheikh... Aladdin died during the battle. Who cares? That's over here. They're running to Zaragoza, so we'll follow. And over here it's a similar story. It's unfortunate the uh, person we're attacking is too young to be captured or killed in battle. So... Yeah, they're running to you. Foi and Carcassonne, which is over here. So I guess we'll follow the larger army, which is Carcassonne. And then we'll head to Foi from there. Alright, that army's toast. Let's go back to Albaracine. We're finally making progress with our first siege over here. Almost done. We should split up our holy orders. Uh, 
And we'll just send them out randomly. Everyone's running to foie. Cool. Ferrara! Yes! Oh my goodness! Finally! And we've improved the Pope's opinion of us by 10. Okay, so Ferrara is done. That took forever, but I'm glad that we went through the effort to do it. Oh, what the fuck? The Pope is getting evaded again? Yes! Go Zogbadids! Go Zogbadids! You actually have... 20,000 guys here now, which should be enough to deal with the Pope's army. Alright, so the Pope likes us a little bit. Let's go back there and make him like us a lot. And good luck, Zogbadids. Oh, Almansa, what are you guys doing? Abadid succession crisis, so you're independent. Oh man, we need to finish this war so that we can get Almansa. That'll give us the whole Duchy of Mercia. Yeah, we gotta stand down our troops, too. They've been up a little too long. Alright. First siege is done. Very good. Keep up the good work. And those guys are toast. And the supply limit here is 3k. You gotta be kidding me. That is embarrassing. 3k. Supply limit. I guess just go back to Rosello. 3k? God damn, that is just terrible. Wow, that's a big succession crisis. Look at this. Damn. Ooh, we gotta be opportunistic here. Anyway, what's going on? Uh, we are already ambitious. No, we are not. Alright, let's gain ambitious. Cool. Oh, 20% chance. Cross your fingers, everybody. We didn't get it. <laughs> oh well. There's only 1 in 5 chance. All right, we're attacking them in the mountains. <laughs> we don't even have it. We don't even have a general in that army. It doesn't matter. A lot of people are dying. No chance of succeeding in this plot, which really sucks. I wonder if we can invite him to court. No? You want a gift? Now you want to invite to court? No. He likes us, though. You want to get married? To my daughter? <laughs> he won't do a matrilineal, though. He's not our spy master. Oh, that's why it's hard to kill him. It's because he's a spy master. Oh, let's let's marry our daughter to him. Why not? You guys are running to Marsan, which is somewhere. Oh, no, they're running to Armagnac. That's fine. So we'll be defending in that battle. Cool. Alright. Now do you want to come to my court? No. 
42% chance of assassinating him, though. Man, that is so tempting. Just straight up assassination attempt. Everyone's converting to Catholic. This is amazing. Alright. We have a grandson. And this guy could eventually rule Poland. It is possible. But it's kill a lot of people, but it's still possible. It's too bad things didn't work out in Denmark. I thought that guy was totally going to die because he was... Uh, what's it called? Uh, really, really sick. He was pneumonic. Oh well. Let's go ahead and get rid of these ships. Alright, making progress. Good, good. All these forts have too many people to just assault. That's eh, okay. Fifty-five percent. You surrender? No, he doesn't surrender. During my visit to the court of King Bernard the First of France, I seem to manage to make him understand what a benevolent ruler you are. Good. So he likes us more. Excellent. We're up to 90 relations. Oh, he's ill, though. Oh, well, at least he had a son. Let's get him betrothed to our granddaughter. Sure. Doesn't matter if it's matrilineal. They're both dearmen. Let's see if we can make some freak babies in France. <laughs> oh, man. You're not making any babies. Why not? You guys have been married for 15 years or so. Please to be hurrying up with this shit. Still no? Okay. Oh yes, the Pope is going to lose. This is so awesome. Oh, we're out of time. Thank you for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed this episode today as we improve our relations with the Pope. This is Shenra from Shenplay signing off. You guys have a good day. And as always, if you enjoy this, then please subscribe. And then it means you can enjoy more of my bullshit. All right, see you guys later.